Tom's. Hey, hey, hey! It's that time of the day when we jump into your week to bring you the best of SciTech right here in Mzanti with many thanks to SAPC Education right here with SAPC 1 in Mzanti for sure. In Jalo Ganyi, I'm glad you are going along back to our roots. I must check you, but it rocks as in the soil and mother earth we're actually from. And of course, we have to keep you guys interested. So, so I'm going to hang out with one of the best artists, Alana Mzanti, who uses natural materials to create the most amazing pieces of art. In other news, see, uh, you can test it, yeah? Mm, yeah, sure, why? Because I have have in Mother Nature to actually thank for it. Why again, my straightener uses a mineral from the earth to heat up and style my hair. Ay, chai, chai, wow, that is very much incredible. In that case, I love it. Let's get it. Find out where the dirt underneath your feet comes from and how it moves around. Meet an incredible creative to see how pieces of nature can be manipulated in the name of art. Get into the groove when we go into the natural science behind straighteners. We're going to about the different types of rock and where they come from. See which digital sources can help you learn more and create paint out of sand. And discover the joy behind a career in the business when we ask our guests for wisdom. So, okay, it's all in rocks. At least you know that you come across young and meet and show. Go to the time and say, I don't know about Zuga Beach. Seriously? Well, I do. Go crap your shop, girl. I mean, again, I don't want to make you look bad. That's a thing. I suppose I'm in I like that. Hey, they don't feel the Hey. <laughs> okay, so I'm from Canada. What do you think soil is made out of? Um, I think from sediment, because during overtime from weathering. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, which which happens over the years. Yeah. If Hua Napula and then the soil, the, the the rocks are broken down yeah. into pieces and they're eroded to a certain place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I ask Nama different types of rocks, mm. like sedimentary rocks. Mm. Some of the soil. Mm -hmm. uh, soil is made out of a uh, like if like yenze yenga ma segments are rock uzona bozihlanganisa like sine sine mihlaba thi ngafani yabona ile ze sengishilo vele from qaleni and by formaka njani ukuthi be soil eh formaka if eh umhlakathi loyo like u amaje if abilikile or ini wow wahlangana enza umhlakathi oyiwani oh umhlaba umhlaba sexually it's ila ma rocks la ovele yabona ma ma break avele so kusala vele la ma small pieces yang tol yeah what type of rocks do we get on earth eh sina ma sedimentary rocks ama engineers rock na ma metamorphic rock metamorphic yeah and what is erosion uh erosion is it's when you young told them erosion um erosion is um <laughs> It's what I've said earlier on, okay, uh, a thing, uh, substances moving from a certain place to yeah. another. Is the, tra is the transportation of soil mm -hmm. to one place to another. I want to say hi to my mom, to my friends, to my family. Uh, hi guys, my family. Hi, I just want to shout out to my mom, my friends, my family. I would like to say hi to my mom, my dad and my sisters. You watching Tom's? Tom's. It's Tom's on SABC one. To one. To one. To one. For sure. Uh, yo. So with all this urgency, stuff I've been wondering about. What's your favorite type of landscape, Monkey? Well, but I really like it deserts, ne? All that space, ne? Send them around. Well, then I guess you're lucky because Africa has the largest desert right here on Earth, is Sahara. Inyan, ne? Kotoke, it deserts aren't only made up of just sand. They actually consist of mostly rock and gravel. Hmm, but sand comes from rock, right? Chalo ga, you see. Soil consists of pieces of rock that has broken off and been grounded into powder, minerals, organic materials from dead plants and animals as well as bacteria. Soil is really important because it provides a place for plants to grow. Also, it stores water for them to use and has lots and lots of minerals. They can also identify soil by many different characteristics like texture, structure, color, density and temperature. Erosion is a process where big things like mountains and rocks are broken into smaller pieces like hills and sand. This can happen in many ways like for example when rain washes soil away and deposits it in a different place. Erosion can be good, like forming new hills and wetlands, or bad because sometimes during floods a lot of good soil is washed away. There is however a very artistic form of erosion out there. Chong Amazon.
Good morning, missioners. We're here to see the Kagasini. We're talking about layers of the earth. So far, we're talking about the two who do sand sculpting. We're just talking about good things. We're talking about why Shogun and you and me. Let's go learn more. Don't want to see shit. We're here to see part of the missioners. And I'm sure we're going to learn about sculpting. No good. We're out here. We're Shogun and lazy, the lazy using layers of the earth. We're here to see Mugran. Sure. Um, Nandi. Yeah. Welcome to TOMZ. I'll tell you. I want to talk again. Can you introduce me? Oh, look, I'm not for talk on that this morning. What do you call this? Sense capture. Ian Zwangan. See, yes, promise and about seeing my pocket, Mrs. Tata Man, so long, yes, mix, Mrs. Stempan Santa, Mrs. Tata is poor, Nekat, and Mrs. Santa. If I'm an instant about Tala, I want to pay. Yeah, I know, I want to pay. I'm a man to the old one. Yeah, I'm going to go home, I'm going to go and it's just cutting on and you tune it in. Go on, go on. Go on, go on. I'm not scooping. I'm not going to spray on us. I'm not going to go on. I'm not going to go on. I'm not going to go on. Oh, you're going to go on. So, for me, it's really more essential all the time. Okay. So, I'm not going to go on. 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 Yeah, what I'm saying. I'm not going to go on. I'm not going to go on. So, you want to go to the Intabata corner, it should be La Macala, any brown, any Nyama. So, in the Ranjan, with a Macala corner, too. Connor, I see Tola corner, both. And Nyama see Tola corner. Okay. So, I'm jelly, gay boy. Besides, in Gagan, Gulam, what is the Lugu, Tatis Catasing Anna, and which we share with it? Oh, it's a tour for soup. Soup, you want? Yeah. Yo. And then my Villanjan would see. Bagnetin bula inga we kute. Inga shonga teka ni swalo ni lo anse. Uh uh. Kuti shalo. Kote ibuge aga ba ibuge njo busandu ya ka no kuti masineti. Of ni guli belu uti tati into shine to zakon. Okay okay. Okay, so I'm jealous, boy. Inspiration, I go to Tati Tlava, to Tati Naman, to Lolo and Jews, Langani, so we share in Tati Manga Zayaga, so you put my good. I'm not sure if it's going to be like this P.O.S. So I'm going to go, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go to my class, yeah. And the man, you're going to go to Ushanga Mara, you know, Ushanga P5, Ushanga Gari. Yeah. Why you choose a lesson to lesson? Oh, for the right now. Saat mereka tu dia akan, kita bangun soke, amaran nak bula, orang pada stop lah, non poci. Sure, 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 sure. Okay, okay. Okay, so macam ni lagi, saya mesti bantu saya pergi equipment, tukar tu saya lemot, tukar tu abah mai be smooth kan cie na. Oh, ikat le lock phone, ne spoon it for it is a ne pan bilin faham makap, ne seng faham kabat, ne foy. Okay. So ngapa ada la kunci, dia kukat pot, dia connect, dia kabat tipe. Tipe. Yo. So in general, I want to be able to do that, obviously. But I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that. I want to be able to support you. I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that. So in general, I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that, and I want to be able to do that. Enge kulonji. Oh, ni kwa bangu kuti ya ingo ba mchampino saul. Oh ya, inza itwa ine. Ya, kuti sali ukuni. Ya. Yo. Aya, this sculpting is too cool. Fair to school nyempela, it's a very mechanical way of shaping natural materials. Another way to do it, though, would be through chemicals. You mean like pouring acid onto a rock to dissolving it? Exactly, but we use materials from the land of Earth for way more than we can imagine. So, lawe na lapekai, unga indao, siya boya kona manj. In our next segment, siya boya nage how tech has taken us from crystals in the Earth to amazing hairstyles. And we take a look at what makes rocks rock. Unga indao. Charms. Welcome back to your favorite science and technology show, bringing you the best and the latest of all the incredible things happening in Konala Mzans. Yonge Kalento has been made possible by Aba Kurunku Nkubobetu, SABC Education, Kwan Kumbilaza SABC, but Mzansi for sure, Oma Gewe Naike Ukewa Poso. We've discovered the most amazing things about the land we walk on. Yonge Emilka, from using it for art to the natural processes that made our environment Lendo Iyi on a plan. Ngu segment Elande Layoga, you guys are going to be blown away when we show you how crystals from the earth can be used to straighten hair. Crazy, right? Mm-hmm. 
You won't get meat like a cement size that are made from rocks which are billions of years old. Um the ceramic mug that you've just put coffee into. Why galoku nesukere is that you used to cut things will have rock in it. Go to Mechugo Uyi Nepadgoma rocks and crystals. Both are made up of minerals, but in crystals, the minerals are put together in a patent or an organized way. They're not messy and all over the place like rocks. Now there are hundreds of different types of rocks, stones, and crystals out there. What are we interested in getting a huyaz makanya ganya ujisamensanjana to style your hair? Some of the most extraordinary colors are reflected from tourmaline. From dark shades of blue, black, and brown to lighter shades of green, yellow, red, and pink. Now the red to pink stones are sometimes heat treated in order to enhance the stone's natural colors, but interestingly enough, the untreated stones almost always fetch a higher price than the chemically or thermally enhanced ones. Now some forms of tourmaline actually change their colors when viewed from different angles. Wow, that is totally cool. Senior in the Amomas, it's always the same old, same old. We just touched down a four ways of a shady salon, but seven side leech, and that has to do with science and technology. Now, as in the Abu Tim Zagajan, you, me, let's go. This part of the years, my face, and I'm trying to talk about layers of the earth. Tourmaline is what we're talking about, and it's the Tulaga Bans, which is the Ishan and Aganjan in New Ali. Hello, how are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. How are you? I'm good, fresh. Good. What's your name? My name is Michelle Stanton. Michelle, welcome to TOMZ. Okay, so Michelle, where are we and what do you do? Today we're at um, our salon, and we're going to be talking about our brand and how we infuse tourmaline in hair technology. Okay, so tell me, what is tourmaline? Tourmaline is a semi precious stone, and what we do in our straightening irons is we actually infuse it into our ceramic plates. Mm -hmm. It enables you to straighten your hair and preserve the life and the well-being of your hair at the same time. Tourmaline is a healing stone. This is a, a, a raw tourmaline stone. Okay. In amongst the hair industry and even the skin, uh, the skin industry, you okay. can find it in skin creams as well okay. because of its healing properties. You can find it on nearly every single continent. Um, it doesn't matter if the environment is hot or cold. Okay. You can find it almost everywhere. From the beautiful watermelon color, that's one of the most um, um, really fine tourmaline mm -hmm. to the most popular being the black tourmaline. Okay, so tell me what inspired you to work with tourmaline? It is so exciting for me. I've always had a passion for hairdressing and hairstyling as a whole and it inspired me to travel the world. I went to different salons from Las Vegas to England, Australia, oh, wow. I, went, I went all over looking for the best technology I could find. I knew what I wanted, I knew what I wanted for my clients, mm -hmm. but the absolute most important part for me mm -hmm. was to how to straighten somebody's hair, get the result that everyone's looking for, but at the same time keeping the condition, keeping the condition beautiful and shiny and preserving the life of the hair. Okay, so Michelle, tell me, what inspired the technology? The technology for me was really inspired for the fact that I wanted beautiful, shiny, straight hair. Mm -hmm. Everything that the tool could give you, but at the same time, I wanted to preserve the life and well-being of the hair. So can you tell me, there's a million stones in this world. What is so special with this stone? What it does, it, it's a healing stone. When you apply heat to the stone, it actually seals off the cuticle and, and it manages to pull in and retain the natural hair moisture. Mm -hmm. So instead of ironing your hair, which usually takes the moisture out of the hair in order to make it straight, mm -hmm. what the tourmaline does is it allows negative irons to be pushed onto the hair cuticle, seal it a lot faster, get a beautiful shine and maintain that health and well-being of the hair and that's why tourmaline is so important to me. Okay so tell me how do you fuse your technology with the stone? How we do it is the tourmaline is actually crushed down into a, a powder format mm -hmm. and it's mixed with the ceramic in the coating mm -hmm. and layered on top of layer okay. um, on the aluminium plate. When the iron is heated up that's mm -hmm. what causes the negative ions on the hair and makes it easy to straighten the hair beautifully and give it the shine. Show me how does it work exactly? Absolutely. So I'm just going to section the hair. Uh -huh and show you, show you a section. I'm first going to take your classic straight style. Okay. Straight from the roots to the tips. What's so beautiful about this brand is you don't have to go over the section over and over and over. Mm -hmm. One Just pass from the roots to the tips gives you that beautiful, shiny, sleek hair. Oh, wow. At the end of the day, it's still heat. Heat can damage the hair. Mm -hmm. But that's why we use the tourmaline. It is so much safer. So tell me, um, the tourmaline stone, is it found in Africa? Or is it outside yes, of Africa? Yes, certainly it is. It's actually found all over the world. But okay. even on our on our continent, and to name a few, Nigeria and, and Madagascar, you can find tourmaline everywhere. Okay, okay. So here I'm going to do a beautiful curl. 
Okay. It's a very simple technique. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. There are three types of rock on Earth. Igneous rocks are formed when molten rock deep in the earth is pushed towards the surface under pressure. Sometimes it even erupts out of volcanoes. When it cools down, igneous rocks are formed. Sedimentary rocks are formed on the earth's surface, in water or on land. When pieces of rock, minerals and biological material heap up, they are kept together with minerals and chemicals. Scientists use the different layers of accumulated things to determine the age of these rocks. Orkdenag metamorphic rocks from deep within the earth where the pressure and heat is so intense that it compacts the rock, making it super dense. Sometimes reactions with fluids also take place, forming a new mineral altogether. Yo, look, we're going to talk about it differently about the earth under our feet. The rocks we kick around and sand we walk on is literally thousands and thousands of years old. Well, guess yeah, the same can be said with the air acidic alokusi perfumlo. That just shows you how people Beautiful the cycle of natural things other and family can just be. Best way at we show you guys a bit more about the history of things forming right here on Earth. Forty, so we need some really, really cool apps. And who knows? We could be talking to you other and too many now. After the break, we dig into the history, literally, of rocks on Earth. We also get some rad career guidance and see a few apps. Terms. I was keeper, 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 but my watch him Zanti say boy like it's your MZ corner like a SAPC one him Zanti for sure. Now again, I'm trying to wheel up completely a local rocking it up on Uma Bona Kunti Wako with some rad info on the science and the technology behind good old mother earth. I saw some of Nan Nibella. Now we've seen how natural rocks can be used to make awesome sculptures or straighten hair. What much again is Kato Kutu Sinigue a bit of history? Well, Germans have been using rocks for thousands of years. Many civilizations are famous for reason that they created out of rock like the Egyptians. What do I think I think boy up in the first? Place. The oldest known rocks on the Earth are more than 4 billion years old. In the early life of the Earth, there were massive amounts of volcanic activity, which caused a lot of lava. When this lava eroded, it formed rocks and iron. Now, South Africa has some of the oldest rock formations on Earth. The Barberton Greenstone Belt is one of the oldest and consists of rocks formed by lava and sedimentation. The Jakobsberg is believed to have formed about 180 million years ago when a part of the Earth bulged up from pressure. Now, Nowadays, scientists are figuring out how to mine minerals from other planets. NASA is making plans to send a new rover to the planet Mars to collect rocks and bring them back to Earth. On a different note though, a genius in the UK has made bricks almost as strong as concrete using only sand and bacteria. Developers are also reinventing the way they use sand to make microchips for tech devices, creating ones that are far smaller than ever before. Hey Bong, since I know that creepy crawly things freak you out, did you know that in just a handful of soil, there are more microorganisms than there are people on Earth? Ugh, see, I really, I really did not need to know that. Although, okay, it's pretty awesome to think that more than 7 billion small creatures in a bit of soil like that? And they actually perform functions that are key to our survival. There really is an endless amount of things that rocks and soil can be used for. Jenge paintings again. So, if you want to know how it's done, or if any of the science info just slipped by you, we've got a few great digital sources to help you get in the know-how. Check it out. Be sure to download e rocks Literally, that's it. This app will give you the lowdown on the formulation and classification of the three most common types of rocks in an awesome interactive way. How cool is that? And for any Alamaka who have an eye for pretty things, get your hands on Iki Minerals Earth Science. Let Planner list different types of minerals in its database, giving you the opportunity to learn what they are made of in Nobuti Abugegaganjani. And because some of you are more hands-on, why not go to www.zoom-kidsforclimate.eu forward slash 122. Lapo instructions on how to make your very own paint They also tell you how to do it with plants. How cool is that? Get it now. We've had a great look at how the earth can be used in science as well as the arts. And yeah, Kariake, that utilizes that very well is landscape design. But because if you want to get into God, there's their on it.
Landscape designers create beautiful outdoor spaces for a wide range of settings. They have to know about soil and plants for the Ama design wana in the Waganjan Gutabe in reality. Many places in Mzansi offer courses in landscape design. Those are Itenga, it's grade 10, standard 8, or work experience. Those are Pina Funde about landscaping and landscaping business, soil and site prep, garden features, or Pina Funde about hardscaping and building procedures, irrigation systems, lighting systems, garden plants, and drawings. You can add to your studies flower arranging, small business management, farming for smallholders, garden design. Recommended subjects are maths or maths literacy, engineering graphics, and design. There are many ways you can go after obtaining training in this field. If you have a love for the outdoors and mother nature, this could just be for you. And just love learning more about it. So I'm advice from our pros. Guys, if you've enjoyed watching today, I'd really like to encourage you to think about this as a career for yourselves. There are loads of colleges around South Africa. Get plugged in. This is the most exciting career available. I like your show today, guys. Keep it up. Now it's like Tanda. So I'm to MC every Monday and Tuesday. Call out SAP. So one more speed is yes, it was great, guys. As you don't say, Nikki. Mom to go from the final shake you again, Nikki. Benson Shall we visit triple W dot Facebook.com forward slash TOMZ at TOMZ underscore SABC underscore one. Sounds we left two and JC La Pana go Instagram see cool I bought it. So bag Instagram. Go Instagram single at Tom's TV underscore SABC one. Now with all that said, keep tweeting, keep Facebook, and Instagram, yes. We out. Exciting news, Tom's fans. This season, so we see launcher with the Tom's T-shirt design competition. Competition? Mm -hmm. Did you see I just say competition? Now what you must do is you must design a super cool image. And the image must have something to do with science and technology. Science, technology, Tom's, yes? Yeah. Then what you do is you upload it, or rather you share it on our Facebook page. Yeah, but it's my Facebook now. The picture that gets most likes, like on the Facebook page here, to sort of print it on the Tom's T-shirt. Not only on Facebook, yeah, but on Twitter as well. When you can comment, then, <laughs> who knows? We might be delivering a t-shirt here. I get all the little Valagan Jalun in Amato Batani Toms. Do not forget to check us out on Facebook and on Twitter. Connors or what's good in Alapemaka? If my banga. Why can you come along to take care of our beautiful earth and to keep it freshly ground? From Tenaga City, adios. Next time on TOMZ, we learn about the wonderful world of sharks and see how maths is used in biology. Be inspired by our Minister of Science and Technology when she tells us about the importance of these subjects for Mzansi. New products, new processes. We see what sharks are made of and what's inside them as we watch a real dissection. And find out how it's possible for sharks to swim so effectively underwater. Mzansi for sure.